All right, in this video, I'm going to take apart my Schlage Everest Primus uh, to see how it works. I've taken apart my uh, my regular Primus, and I'm thinking it's probably the same exact way, um, except this guy has the C123 key and uh, with a little. I'm not sure if you can make that out, but it has a little notch on the side of it, like a like a regular Everest key, except uh, it is cut up. And what it does is it not only lifts but turns the uh, the pins in the uh, the plug there that uh, engages sidebar. All right. Uh, so let's start that now. And I think I'll take one of the, the pins out, just because, well, maybe I'll take the whole thing out, I don't know. We'll see how it goes. Um, I found my tool before. This is a, a little flag tool I made out of a pin vise. <clears throat> I lost it before, and uh, so now I have that. My little guy took it. All right, so let's see. I get a follower. Let's see how this works here. Um, the key pins, I'm not too worried about. It's the whole sidebar and the smaller pins popping out. Yeah, there's a lot of tension behind here. A lot of spring tension. Okay, so those are the key pins. Um, all regular. I'm not sure what order they go in, but that's fine. Yeah, all steel. And so this all looks normal. And then if you flip it over, uh, that's not so normal. Now these are the, uh, I'm not sure what you would call these, um, but anyways, they're lifted and turned, um, and they all have notches in them that uh, interact with the sidebar here. So here's the sidebar, and uh, the sidebar pins. Or springs, just two little springs here. I don't want to lose those. And then if you pull the key out, I'll take out one of these pins. You're going to have to hold on to it, or else it'll come flying out because it's under spring tension. Okay, so there it is. It also has a spring in there, smaller spring than a regular. I'm not sure how well I'm focusing here. All right. So this is going to be at the pointing towards the top of the keyway. That's where the spring is, and the key is going to be pulled. So in this case. Um, pull towards the rear of the keyway a little bit because if you see this notch doesn't line up with there. So, so your sidebar is not going to have room to go until it's pulled up and it goes in this little slot. So in this case it's going to be towards the back of the keyway and it's going to be lifted. Uh, this pin doesn't have any type of false gates or anything like that. Um, I doubt the other ones do, but it's extremely precise the way this thing is machined like this. Um, I haven't tried to pick this lock open, um, but I'm going to need a small flag to do so or a sideways half diamond maybe. 
but very difficult to pick, I'm thinking. And then uh, I'll take a look at the drivers. In the uh, regular Primus, the drivers are all regular. So there's that. And uh, you know, I would show you how it reacts uh, or how it engages the key, but here's the regular Primus key. It's kind of the same idea. It's going to be pushed or pulled to the correct height. And uh, the correct angle. So that's that. And while I got this open, I think I'm just going to spill out these driver pins and see how the springs are and maybe clean it up a little bit. Right. Yeah, just standard drivers, brand new springs. Uh, look like steel drivers also. Or maybe brass drivers. No, it looks like brass. It's hard to tell. They're very clean, very new. Mm. And I think I'm gonna take the rest of these guys out and just clean it up a little bit and polish it, maybe. It's still in pretty new condition. Um, the regular Primus wasn't, it was a little older, so I polished that guy up a little better. Um, Alright, I think that's it. Happy picking, and uh, if you have any questions, uh, um, you can pop those in the comment section. And this guy over here, um, because it is a regular Schlage um, key and key type, or key and knob type uh, type cylinder, you can put it in a uh, padlock body, and it'll fit just like a regular one. You just need to replace the tailpiece. Like, It'll fit in the sky over here, the same thing. This is a, an older kryptonite lock, but uh, it would fit. So imagine that a kryptonite uh, lock body with a Schlage Primus Everest. That would be probably the better combination that Schlage has to offer. All right, well, thanks for watching.